Omega-3 fatty acids are crucial for your health. They are involved in many functions of your body, such as maintaining healthy cell membranes, producing hormones, regulating inflammation, and supporting your brain and heart health. However, your body cannot make omega-3s on its own, so you need to get them from your diet or supplements. There are three main types of omega-3s which are ALA, EPA, and DHA. ALA is found in plant sources such as flax seeds, chia seeds, walnuts, and soybeans, while EPA and DHA are mainly found in fish and seafood. But unfortunately, many people do not get enough omega-3s from their diet, especially if they do not eat enough fish or plant sources. This can lead to a deficiency that can affect your health in many ways. So in this video, we will talk about seven signs of omega-3 deficiency and how to fix it. Number one, dry skin or poor skin health. One of the first signs of omega-3 deficiency may be dry, sensitive, or irritated skin. This is because omega-3s help improve the integrity of your skin barrier preventing moisture loss and protecting it from environmental damage. They also have anti-inflammatory effects that can help reduce skin redness and acne. A study found that women who took flaxseed oil for three months had improved skin hydration and smoothness compared with a placebo group. Another study found that hemp seed oil reduced dryness and itchiness in people with eczema. So, to improve your skin health, you should aim to get at least 1.1 grams of ALA per day for women and 1.6 grams for men. You can also take fish oil or algae oil supplements that provide EPA and DHA, which have been shown to help reduce acne. Number two, joint pain or stiffness. Omega-3s have anti-inflammatory properties that can help prevent or treat arthritis, a condition that causes joint pain and stiffness. Omega-3s can reduce the production of inflammatory molecules called eicosanoids, which are involved in joint inflammation and cartilage damage. Several studies have shown that omega-3 supplements can improve symptoms of rheumatoid arthritis, such as joint swelling, tenderness, and morning stiffness. They may also reduce the need for painkillers or anti-inflammatory drugs. According to the World Health Organization, you should aim to get at least 250 milligrams of EPA and DHA per day. You can also eat more fatty fish such as salmon, sardines, mackerel, or herring, which are rich in these omega-3s. Number 3. Mental Health Problems Omega-3s make up a large part of your brain cells and help regulate neurotransmitters, which are chemical messengers that control your mood, memory, learning, and behavior. Omega-3 deficiency has been linked to various mental health problems, such as depression, anxiety, bipolar disorder, schizophrenia, ADHD, and dementia. Several studies have shown that omega-3 supplements can improve symptoms of these conditions by reducing inflammation and oxidative stress in the brain. Before we continue, if you have been finding this video helpful, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss more videos like this. Now let's get back to the video. Number four, poor vision or eye health. Omega-3s are important for your eye health and vision. DHA is a major component of your retina, which is the part of your eye that converts light into nerve signals. EPA helps produce substances that protect your eyes from damage and inflammation. An omega-3 deficiency can affect your eye health in several ways. It can increase your risk of dry eye syndrome, which causes irritation, redness, blurred vision, and increased sensitivity to light. It can also increase your risk of age-related macular degeneration, AMT, which is a leading cause of vision loss in older adults. Number five, poor memory or cognitive decline. Omega-3s are essential for your memory and cognitive function. They help maintain the structure and function of your brain cells and support the communication between them. They also help prevent or slow down the decline of your cognitive abilities as you age. So, an omega-3 deficiency can impair your memory and cognitive performance. It can affect your learning, attention, concentration, and problem-solving skills. 
It can also increase your risk of Alzheimer's disease and other forms of dementia, which are characterized by progressive memory loss and cognitive impairment. Number six, poor immune system or increased infections. Only the threes are very important for your immune system and its ability to fight off infections. They help modulate the balance between pro-inflammatory and anti-inflammatory responses in your body. They also help enhance the function of various immune cells, such as macrophages, neutrophils, natural killer cells, and T cells. An omega-3 deficiency can weaken your immune system and make you more prone to infections. It can increase the levels of inflammation and oxidative stress in your body, which can damage your tissues and organs. It can also impair the activity and function of your immune cells, making them less effective at killing pathogens. Number seven, poor wound healing or increased bleeding. Only the threes are involved in the process of wound healing and blood clotting. They help promote the formation of new blood vessels and tissue repair in the wound site. They also help prevent excessive bleeding by regulating the production of clotting factors in platelets. So, an omega-3 deficiency can impair your wound healing and increase your bleeding tendency. It can delay the healing of wounds and increase the risk of infection and scarring. It can also reduce the levels of clotting factors and platelets in your blood, making it harder for your blood to clot when you get injured. Now you know the signs of omega-3 deficiency, but how can you fix it? Well, the best way to fix omega-3 deficiency is to increase your intake of foods that contain these essential fats. The main sources of omega-3s are fatty fish such as salmon, sardines, mackerel, herring, anchovies, and tuna, seafoods such as oysters, mussels, shrimp, scallops, and crab. Or you can find it also in plant sources such as flax seeds, chia seeds, walnuts, hemp seeds, tofu, sprouts, kale, spinach, and broccoli. You should aim to eat at least two servings of fatty fish or seafood per week, according to the American Heart Association. Other than that, you should also include plant sources of omega-3s in your daily diet. If you do not eat enough omega-3 rich foods or have a higher need for these fats due to certain health conditions or life stages, such as pregnancy or breastfeeding, you may benefit from taking supplements that provide EPA and DHA. The most common types of omega-3 supplements are fish oil, which is derived from the tissues of oily fish, algae oil, which is derived from marine algae that produce EPA and DHA or krill oil, which is derived from small crustaceans that feed on algae. Always remember before taking any supplement to consult with your doctor to determine the right dose and type for you. You should also check the quality and purity of the supplements you choose and avoid those that contain contaminants such as mercury or PCBs. So what do you think? Do you have some of these symptoms? Share with us your experience and opinion in the comments below. Thanks for watching.